Welcome to another episode of Die Project Tinkercast Code Blocks 3D Tutorial. In this video, we are going to make a candlelight holder. So, for this, I am renaming my project. This candlelight holder will be for tea lights. So, after that, I am going to create an object. This is my object. After that, I am going to my shapes where I will take two cylinders. You can use torus if you want. So I'm going to modify my cylinder changing the height of the cylinder, radius of the cylinder and the size of the cylinder. Now my first cylinder the radius will be 42, height will be 100 and the size will be 100. and I am moving it in Z axis by 50 units. The radius of my second cylinder will be 40 and height and the size will be the same. I am moving it by 50 units. After that I am going to check it how my object is created. So this is my cylinder. My sub second cylinder is a hole here. After making that I am going to create two loops, two for loops. Inside that for loop, I am going to use a star. Here my two groups are created, sorry, two loops are created. So I am taking a star from the shape, I am adding it here. I am changing the radius of the star to 5. After that I am going to modify it. I am going to rotate it twice. One in Z axis and one in X axis. After doing that I am going to move it. So let's rotate it. Duplicate the rotate. Now in X axis it will be 90 degrees. After doing that I am going to move it. I am going to move in Y axis and Z axis. Now I am rotating the Z axis. For this I am going to use the values of my loop. So for this I am going to use some arithmetic operators. I am going to use an addition operator, multiplication operator, I am using my I value to move the star one above the another by 15 units in Z axis. Each time my once the loop is completed, each time the star is moved 15 units above the previous star. After that, for rotation, I am rotating it in Z axis by the value of my loop so one of my value will be my first loop which will form a circle and the second value will be for the second loop the rotation angle will be 45 units each time when the loop is running Every 45 units, a star will be placed around the cylinder. So we are setting the value as 45 and with addition with 22.5. The number of times my loop should repeat will be 6. 
The six represents number of stars in a circumference and uh, my second loop the value will be 8 which is number of rows after this I am creating a group out of it and changing the color to yellow so my loop is running now let's see what we have created mm, the loop is running but my stars are not forming I think I have made an error I forgot to add the y axis value so the stars are at the center of my cylinder you can see it from the bottom angle so all my stars are created and it is in the center I'm just adding the y value it's done Something is yet to be corrected. Hmm, what is the mistake I have done? Oh, I forgot to add the angle of pivot to my rotation in Z axis. So when you use this pivot, that object is rotated from the position that we have fixed. So my stars are started getting placed. My object is being greater. It's done. This is my candlelight holder. If you like the video, press the like button, put your feedback in the comment box, share the video. Let's see you in the next video.